Hi everybody. So if you've been wondering which way is best for you to sit your AWS certification exam, whether online or on premise, then this video is for you. So let's take a look at the factors where online testing outstands. Of course, you will be saving time. You don't need to worry about traffic, transport, and so on, especially if you're someone driving, therefore, you will definitely save energy. You'll save costs because you don't need to order taxi or an Uber. If you live very, very far from the nearest test center, then your only choice is to take your test online. If you're someone who takes care of a sick person in your household and no one can take your place, then definitely you must take your test online and this way in case of any emergency you will be able to drop everything and go take care of this person now online testing do come with its downsides you will need to be present in a closed room alone and you are not allowed to leave the space covered by the webcam or the camera you are using so if you're someone living in a small flat or a small condo then you may need to discuss it with your roommate in order to be on your own during the testing time if that's not possible then you'll definitely need to take it on premise and ethernet is highly recommended so if you're not able to guarantee this then you may run into some technical issues and also you will be involved in these issues in order to solve it so you will be contacted by your proctor in order to fix this problem and this is just a waste of energy i believe so yeah just consider this and also another thing is that if you're using the Wi-Fi, it's recommended to ask others in your household not to use the Wi-Fi, which actually might be very uncomfortable for them in these days of internet. No one is actually offline. If you're taking your test on premise, then you don't need to think about all of this. You will just sit aside in case of any technical issue and the technical staff will solve it for you. Keep in mind that breaks are not allowed during online testing. So if you're someone who struggles with some issues and you need to go to the toilet frequently, then you should consider taking your test on premise. Although the testing time will not stop, however, you are able to solve your problem. This is mentioned here on the AWS page during testing or test day now I will include the link below and you will see it here so the testing rules scheduled breaks are not configured for AWS certification exams so for exams at the test center you are permitted to take unscheduled breaks the time of the exam will not stop during an unscheduled break However, for online proctored exams, as we said, you are not permitted to stand up from or leave the view of the camera for any reason for the duration of the exam, including for a restroom break or any other kind of break. However, I found this article on the A Cloud Guru blog and the author of this article asked the proctor if he'll be allowed to have a bathroom break if needed the proctor said yes but he didn't test this i will include this link also so if you want to see more from this article you can read it another advantage of taking your test on premise is to make new friends and colleagues who work in the same field so i hope this was helpful please let me know if you have any questions in the comments and see you in next videos